One of the wealthiest families in the United States is the Hunt family. Their wealth originated from early investments made by Atchel Hunt in the American oil industry. His son, the late Lamar Hunt, was an original owner of the Kansas City Chiefs and a founding member of the American Football League. Grandson Clark Hunt serves as the current CEO of the Kansas City Chiefs, who triumphed in this year's Super Bowl. It was widely known that Harrelson Lafayette Hunt was one of the wealthiest individuals in all of America. He became wealthy working in the petroleum industry. In 1936, he established Hunt Oil Company as a business. According to reports, he was able to use the revenues from his oil business to invest in other businesses, including publishing, cosmetics, and even pig and farming. He was quite successful in the oil business. Hunt passed away in 1974 with an estimated net worth ranging from $2 billion to $3 billion at the time of his death. According to Forbes, Hunt had 15 children with three separate women, and he deposited their share of his income into trusts for each of their offspring. The American Football League was established by Lamar Hunt, who was one of the Hunt's sons. When Lamar passes away, the team was passed on to his and Nura's children. They are the current owners of the franchise. They also have a real estate portfolio that includes Subtropolis in the Kansas City, which is a subterranean corporate complex. After her father bequeathed the Rosewood Corporation to her, Carolyn Hunt, Lamar's sister, established Rosewood Hotels and Resorts in the year 1979. In 2018, she passed away. William Herbert Hunt, their brother, helmed the family business, Petro Hunt, which dealt in oil and gas. He is now involved with the company only in an advisory capacity, and along with him, numerous other family members run the business. According to Forbes, another brother named Ray Lee Hunt is the wealthiest of all 15 siblings in her Hunt family. Grandson Clark Hunt is the current Chief Executive Officer of the Kansas City Chiefs. He has a net worth of $5.2 billion and serves as the chairman of the Hunt Consolidated Inc. at present. Clark Hunt has been a part of the leadership of the Kansas City Chiefs for close to 20 years, and he presently holds the positions of chairman and chief executive officer of the team. The turnaround of the Chiefs into one of the most successful teams in the National Football League is largely attributed to the contributions made by Hunt who has been a primary catalyst in the team's recent success. Since I took over as Chiefs CEO in 2010, the team has won seven titles in the AFC West Division and appeared in nine postseason games. Following the 2019 and 2020 seasons, the club won two consecutive AFC championships and earned consecutive appearances in the Super Bowl for the first time in the history of the franchise. Hunt was the first player in the franchise's history to win the award that bears the name of his father, the Lamar Hunt Trophy. Following the conclusion of the 2019 season, the team was awarded a second Lombardi Trophy for their victory in the Super Bowl Ally Week. Hunt, who has been a member of the Management Council Executive Committee for a significant amount of time, played an important role in securing the National Football League's most recent two collective bargaining agreements in 2011 and 2020, respectively. Throughout the years that he serves as head of the International Committee 2011 and 2018, Hunt was a staunch supporter of broadening the scope of the NFL's international activities and its presence in other countries. Since 2007, the NFL has held a total of 30 games in London, including four battles in the brand new Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. This venue was built through a collaboration between the NFL and the British Premier League team, and it has served as the site of the four of those games. Since 2016, the National Football League has also played three games during the regular season in Mexico, 
The National Football League announced in 2022 that it will play one of its regular season games in Germany each year through the 2025 season. Munich and Frankfurt will take turns playing host to these games. In 2022, there are a total of five international matches scheduled to take place. One of these matches will take place in Mexico City's Estadio Azteca, while the other four will take place in the United Kingdom, two at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium and one at Wembley Stadium. The match in Munich will take place at the Allianz Arena. Clark Hunt is the son of the legendary American sports pioneer and founder of the Chiefs Lamar Hunt. Clark Hunt has built upon his father's legacy by ensuring that the Chiefs organization remains focused on its core mission, which is to honor tradition, unite our community, win with character, and inspire our fans. The Kansas City Chiefs were victorious in the Super Bowl and took home the trophy. The multi-billionaire Hunt family, who owns the squad, has experienced this feeling many times before. Because of this victory on Sunday, the Chiefs have now won the Venus Lombardi Trophy for the third time in their franchise's history and the second time in the last four seasons. The Chiefs were victorious over the Philadelphia Eagles by a score of 38 for 35, and the game's most valuable player, top-class quarterback Patrick Mahomes, was awarded the trophy for his outstanding performance. During the celebration that took place after the game, Chiefs Chairman and CEO Clark Hunt remarked, What a magnificent trophy. He was referring to the new piece of the hardware that his family had received. Without Andy Reid, who is widely regarded as one of the finest head managers in the annals of the National Football League, we should not have been able to achieve this. And what an incredible showing today by the Patrick Mahomes and the rest of his teammates. The Hunt family is one of the wealthiest families in the United States with a total estimated worth of $20.5 billion. This is an increase from their estimated worth of $15.3 billion just three years earlier, when they last won the Super Bowl. The family has investments in a variety of properties, including sports clubs in the National Football League, the National Basketball Association, and Major League Soccer oil and gas corporations located all over the world, and a huge underground industrial park. The club has continued to make improvements to the stadium over the previous four years to improve the overall experience for the fans and ensure that the venue retains its status as one of the best home field advantages in the league. This work includes the replacement of each seat in the seating ball, an upgrade in the technology, used for the scoreboard and video board, the renovation of the team store, the renovation of the locker room complex, the introduction of the additional premium club and suite options, and the renovation of the Chiefs Hall of Honor into a fully enclosed contemporary digital experience that celebrates the past, the present, and future of the franchise. How was the video? Did you enjoy it? Tell us in our comment section below and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more updates.